a fight that me and you talked about previously, Dan. Terrence Crawford, Earl Spence. Terrence Crawford stops Earl Spence in spectacular fashion. Yeah. Now they're talking about the rematch. From what I hear, my sources tell me that the rematch is definitely going to be at 154 pounds. Yeah. Does the fight look different? The fight look different? I definitely think um, it's going to be more competitive, but I, I see it in the same way. More competitive, but in the same way. Yeah. What does Earl Spence have to do to get that W? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Man, that's a tough one. I don't know. I don't know. He definitely going to have to be sharper. Um, not picking up that back foot or not falling so much with his left hands and just be a crisper boxer. But that's that's a that's a tough task. I definitely think on this second try, it'll be more competitive, but I don't see it in any different. Can a zebra change their stripes? At this point, I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah, you know, it's, uh, it's hard to teach an old dog new tricks. So, uh, that is what it is. If it, if it looks like it did last time, sure. Earl Smith's backing up and retire. No, I definitely think he's definitely still a top, uh, you know, an elite, an elite top boxer. And I'm sure at 154, there's a bunch of people we can beat. There's a lot more money to be made. A lot more belts to be gotten. So, um, I'm definitely not telling him to pack it up. He lost to the number one fighter in the world, pound for pound. So it's like, it's not really no shame in that.